It's clobbering time! Hello everybody! Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel once again. I'm Robert Storms. If you're finding me for the very first time, be sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button. I want to personally take this time to thank each and every one of you guys for helping me get over 10,000 subscribers. I love each and every one of you. The next giveaway will be once I reach 11,000. So Marvel announced that they're going to relaunch the Fantastic Four comics. And yes, this is a big deal for a couple reasons. One, there hasn't been a Fantastic Four comic in three years. But now Marvel decided they're going to reunite the first family. But here is the reason why you guys should care about another series of Fantastic Four coming back to the comics. Because Marvel stopped producing Fantastic Four comics. Many people speculated because they didn't own the rights to the characters. So instead of promoting Fox's movies with the comic books, they just decided just to kill the comics all together. Now, out of nowhere, they decide to relaunch the Fantastic Four just as Disney is trying to purchase Fox. That's kind of a coincidence, ain't it, guys? Ain't it? Could it be possible that an end credit scene at the end of Avengers 4 might show a glimpse of the first family? Maybe we see Galactus. Maybe we see Silver Surfer. But I do think there is some significance about the fact that Marvel has chosen now, right now, to decide to relaunch the first family. Look, does that mean we're going to get a Fantastic Four movie right away from Marvel? No, that doesn't mean that at all. But I do think things are starting to move along a lot faster than we know about here in the public. And I think now is a good time for Marvel to say, okay, let's reintroduce the Fantastic Four. Let's try to get some of these new readers who may not know much about the Fantastic Four and let's relaunch the comic book. That way new readers can come in, start to learn more about the characters. That way a couple years down the line, if this deal with Fox does go through, then they can start peppering the characters into other movies and then eventually do a Fantastic Four standalone movie. Because I am one of the people that think, yes, the Fantastic Four will happen over at Marvel, but I don't think we're just gonna come out of the gate with a Fantastic Four movie. I think Think that would be stupid. Marvel Studios and Disney is not stupid. The reason why Black Panther and Spider-Man Homecoming worked so well was because they introduced those characters in Captain America's Civil War. I truly, deeply believe at the end of Avengers 4, however that movie turns out, we will see some kind of Easter egg from some kind of character in the Fantastic Four, whether it's Silver Surfer, Galactus, Reed Richard, or Doctor Doom. I am so certain that we are going to get some kind of glimpse of one of those characters which will then spin off into the next phase of the MCU. Perhaps Galactus will be the next main villain after Thanos, because once you get done with Thanos, where do you go? Why not go to the Planet Eater and have to have our heroes once again team up with new characters like the Fantastic Four? Maybe the mutant gene gets triggered, and then somehow the mutant starts showing up, and then the X-Men starts showing up, or maybe they've been dormant and just hiding from the outside world. There are so many different ways that they can spin off the next phase of Marvel movies, and I just find coincidental that out of nowhere Marvel decides now we're going to relaunch the first family in the Fantastic Four comics guys but I want to know what you guys think do you think there is a purpose behind the relaunch of the Fantastic Four be sure to leave those comments in the comment box below be sure to hit that like button once again you're finding my channel for the very first time be sure to hit that subscribe button until next time guys as always I'm Robert Storms and that's my opinion